guys, it is Sunday morning. It's almost seven o'clock and I'm about to sit down and edit the video you're about to see and the one that we'll post tonight. I just wanted to come on and apologize really quick that I didn't get this video up last night when it was supposed to go up. Um, I was going to get up yesterday and edit and that was the plan because I edit the next morning most days. But the night before I filmed the rest of this video, it's a little confusing. Um, we discovered a dog issue, which you'll learn about in this video, and you'll learn more about in the one that posts tonight. So we had to deal with that all day yesterday, and then, as if that wasn't bad enough, we had another dog issue, which was a very serious emergency. We had to go to the emergency vet. All is good now. Yeah, you'll see about that in the video tonight. So I just wanted to let you know that and apologize for not getting the videos up in time. Obviously, the dogs were my priority. They always will be over YouTube. So you guys know that about me. All right, enjoy the rest of this video. I just finished editing my video, the vlog 14, vlogmas 14, and now it's rendering. That's what it looks like when it's rendering. And it came out to, I, I thought I wasn't going to have much content at all, but I ended up having a few talking segments and it came out to almost 15 minutes. And that's taking, it just said 40 cents, so about 40 minutes, almost an hour to render. It's already been doing it for a few minutes. So, I'm still really tired. And, oh, excuse me. I'm going to, I got up at uh, 4. And, I, gosh, I went to bed at like 8 last night. That's how tired I was. So I got up at about four today, and while this is rendering, I'm gonna go take my shower and get ready, and then I can come back and schedule it to upload to YouTube. Hello, Roxy. Hello. I'm leaving for work, Roxy. I'm so sorry. I want to stay here with you, but you know, then you wouldn't have dog food. Bye, Roxy, I love you. Bye, Vincent Bird. Look at this mess you've made. Bye. Where's Baron? Roxy, where's Baron? You're not supposed to jump from there. Come here. Come here. Brr. Did he get locked in my room? Baron, are you in there? Baron, come on. Come on. You don't want to be locked in there all day. Bye, Baron. Bye, Baron. Roxy, I'm trying to cut your brother. Oh, I should put shoes on. Yeah. I guess I shouldn't wear my slippers to work. Bye. I love you guys. I'll see you later. Heading into Target for a couple things. We're supposed to get chocolates for Christmas presents, and the boyfriend wants hand, sand, hand soap. And the boyfriend wants hand soap. It's probably pretty windy out here. Sorry about that. Look, they have a new dachshund mug. I find these basket displays so odd. Just giant baskets. Christmas section. Hmm. This is where I'll find all the Christmas candy. I love the nutcrackers. I don't have any from Target yet. Very cool. This is my loot so far. Got that. That's pretty cool. Little advent calendar, reindeer, um, nutcracker. As a prize for our family party, we're gonna have some games. And I got that one from somebody in the family who just left or just went through basic training for National Guard. This is that Hearth and Hand by Magnolia, the Gaines family that does that. Um, what is that show? They're out of Waco, Texas. I forget the name of it. But uh, that's them there. Those guys. I like these bags. Those are pretty. Target has such pretty displays. I'm not crazy about this store like so many people seem to be, like obsessed with it. But they do have some pretty displays. Y'all hear her barking? She stopped because she knows it's me now. It's good to see doggies again. Not like yesterday where there were no doggies. 
Hi, Baron. Hello, Roxy. One of the things we're doing at our family Christmas party are some games and some gift exchanges. And like the White Elephant gift exchange has a $20 limit. And I'm doing four of those gifts because there's one each for me and the boyfriend at two different parties. So I have three of the gifts and I decided to do this. This is the last one. I got this idea off the internet. I got this jar for $2 at Target, taking the lid off. And I got these M&Ms and I'm gonna fill it up with M&Ms. And then I have this $20 bill and I'm gonna fold that up and stick it down in the M&Ms and then finish covering it. I'm gonna stick it down farther than that. Cover that baby up. Oops, I did a little too much. Put the lid on it and then I'll put a ribbon in there and uh, it just looks like a jar of M&Ms. Uh-oh, I think I see the bill sticking out right there. I'll have to fix that. But people will think, what is this? I just got M&Ms, it was supposed to be $20. That's like $2. But the people who watch my channel are gonna know there's a $20 bill in there so they can snag this. Then they get $20 and chocolate. And the other jar I'm gonna fill with these marshmallows and then we'll have a game to guess how many marshmallows are in the jar and whoever gets it closest without going over will win the marshmallows and the chocolate sprinkles and some hot chocolate that I haven't purchased yet. Aren't these the most beautiful poinsettias? The variegated, the light's probably not doing them justice, but they're really pretty. Bye guys, we're leaving. Bye Vincent. You're locked up so you don't get into all the Christmas foods. Sorry, but you know you would do it. Bye guys, love you. We're about to go through this intersection and there's a really bad accident here. There's a car on top of another car. Can you see this? Oh my God. How the hell did that happen? That's my favorite kind of decorations. Clean and simple. And I love it when trees are wrapped like that. That is gorgeous. They make the best margaritas here. Or some of the best margaritas in town anyway. The best frozen ones for sure. Say that again? What is that? A battered and fried stuffed avocado stuffed with spinach, cheese, and I'm not sure what else. Mystery meat. Mystery meat. All right. <laughs> we got refills on our margaritas. And I got my usual which is a chalupa that I never end up eating because I'm always too full by the time I get to it. This I already started eating. It's a little tortilla thing with queso on it and then a cheese enchilada. Wait, wait, I have to film this first. Don't eat it. So this is their tres leches, but they've changed it for the holidays. One of the milks has been changed to an eggnog and they've got gingerbread man on top and some of the bread is ginger man I think oh okay fine go for it do it do it let's see taste it see what you think how is it Santa Maria <laughs> okay are you gonna leave any for me no 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 
Tell I'm going to film you, this. I'm going to tell these people tell what you, you swam, did. When you I was on the phone. Excuse me. I'm talking. I was on the phone. Excuse me. I I was on the phone texting my sister, and I look up, and this is all that's left of the tres leches, the special holiday edition with the gingerbread and the eggnog. And and he, I look up, and he says, that's all yours. And I said, well, I guess it better be because I only had two bites of the whole thing. That was awfully rude. <clears throat> and his quote was... Uh-huh. <clears throat> Speak into the microphone. <clears throat> when you snooze, you lose. Okay. I wasn't snoozing. I was texting my sister. Heading back home. We're on Interstate 59, and they have these awesome lights on the bridges. You see how there are these walls here on both sides? This, when we flood really bad, this entire thing is flooded, like, over the walls. That's happened more than once. Hey guys, I'm filming this the next morning, so we had a busy night and I was very tired and I slept in until uh, like 7.30 this morning. It's pretty late for me. But what happened was we went out to see a friend of ours who's a musician and she had a little gig she was doing and we went to see that. It was I didn't film there because it was this really small intimate space. It was in an art gallery and just didn't feel appropriate to film. But uh, you all saw that car accident we saw on the way there. Oh my gosh, I hope everybody was okay. Um, it looked like maybe they were. Like it, it didn't look like the drivers or passengers areas were damaged, so that's good. But there was a car on top of another car. After the show, we went out for Mexican food. You saw that too. And then when we got back home, I was cuddling with the dogs and I noticed this red spot on Baron. So we got home pretty late and I was really tired and did not feel did not feel like filming the reflections and the advent calendar. So, and we had some other things going on that I'll tell you about in tomorrow's video. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the reflection question now and I'm gonna be kind of quick about it because I have a lot to do today. As you will see in the vlog tomorrow, there's some stuff going on that we weren't expecting we were gonna have to deal with. So. Um, the question for today is, what little things did you most enjoy during your day-to-day -day life? And, I mean, that has to be the dogs. They're my favorite things. <laughs> so I always enjoy just coming home to them, and you see how excited they are when I come home. And I just love coming home to them and cuddling and having fun. It's, it's, uh, that's the best part of my day. And let's go do the advent calendar. All right, this would be, let me see. Yesterday was the 14th, so it would be door 14. Okay, we did 13 last time. Where is 14? I feel like I look with my eyeballs instead of looking on camera, so I don't really see. We've got 24, 15, or I, I don't let you guys see, sorry. 18, 16, 19, 4, 6, 5, 10, 23, 20, 21, 1, 16, 2, 12, 11, 9, 22, 13, 3, 17, 7. I didn't see 14 anywhere. Is there no 14? Am I missing something? I have to be. There's got to be a 14, right? 17. I'm confused. There's 15, 16, 17, 14. It looks like a 6. That's a problem. Okay. Can you see that? It looks, that looks like a 6. All right. Let's punch her. Ah! Let's punch that out. Open up. Oh, a big bottle of something. It's like the shampoo bottles. Let's see what this is. Fleur de Cerises. Cherry Blossom. And what is it? Uh, bath and Shower Gel. Oh, that's nice. I don't really use those. That'll probably go in somebody's stocking. But it's nice. It's, it sounds like a really lovely scent, too, Cherry Blossom. So here you go, Cherry Blossom. Let's put you next to, sorry about Vincent squealing back there. I hate those high-pitched whistles. They give me headaches. All right, now the bottle is with the other bottles that look like it and all is good with the world. 